Okay, how's everybody doing tonight? And um, please let me know how my audio is doing because I did not get to do a free stream test on this. Sorry, we're running a little bit later than I would like to. But hey, here we are. We are trying out Technomancer, starting a brand new Saturday stream series. So, yeah. Um, oh, I guess for the new people I should be saying, hey, I'm Blaster Toad. welcome to Toadnet. And yeah, we just finished up Wolfenstein, now we're going to take a change up. And thanks again to Simon Roach, who, um, one of our subscribers who suggested this to us, so... Hey, if it's great, thank him. If it's horrible, blame him, it's not my fault. <laughs> okay. Yes, yesterday I was playing some, um, this war of mine. It was a good game. So yeah, that that happens. Okay, well let's um let's start this up without any further ado. And yeah, we're not gonna take the extreme, but we'll always go for a little bit of a challenge. I get my comfy shirt on today. Sometimes you just need like that old raggedy comfy shirt to sit around in. Oh yeah. I'm so comfy. Now you all know, cause I got the shirt on. In death. Since the turmoil, there have been unending wars, fought over the possession of clean water. We are the forgotten they fight over water. Earth, okay. Trapped in this red, barren wasteland. Here, hell is not a concept. It's our reality. And the reality is that every drop counts. Then there were the unfortunates, caught in the full power of the sun's radiation, forced to deform, mutate into unrecognizable monsters. The others, the ones who remained similar to our ancestors in likeness, hid under massive metal shells governed by water corporations. But in the slums, people's lives aren't worth much more than the mutants. And I would know that's where I spent the first ten years of my life, under the boot of the Vori. Of course, in despair, there is hope. Some have begun to explore, travel even, from corporation to corporation, leaving their loyalties behind. Explorers. We have Most organization, structure, and inevitably, politics. We have rulers, a people's assembly, and far removed from us, the Dowser, the inaccessible face of abundance. And finally, there's us, the elite protectors of the people, Ooh, the spearhead of the army, my brothers and sisters who all share the same special gift. We are Technomancers. Nice! Character customization time, guys. Oh, it's kind of preset. I was expecting more. I think that face... can move it around. Okay, so that one kind of sweeps one side. That one sweeps the We're going to stay with that one. Ah, oh, the red is too light. Yeah, we'll go with that kind of like auburn brown. And then eye color, okay. Scary blue. Okay. So, what are we doing? We got charisma, science, 
crafting, exploration, unless you increase or in collect dead critters. Okay, well, we'll see you later then, Hated. Ooh, picking level one locks and set traps. Steal items. I think crafting. Attributes. Strength. Agility. Okay. Damage caused. Da -da 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 -da. Chance of critical hit with weapons is plus one percent. Chance of critical hit with spells is plus two percent. Just power. Power amplifies spells unless you cast them more often. Faster casting. That's up there. Constitution. Makes you more resilient, just gives us extra health. Let's do speed of casting. There we go. Yeah, we'll continue our adventure with scary blue eyes. Ahoy, Zachariah. Scott, you came. Wouldn't miss it for the world. Sure, my memory isn't what it... But I remember to write things down on my calendar. Although I do sometimes forget where my calendar is. Anyhow, I knew your last cadet mission was today. Any nerves? If it's any consolation, you look more than fit enough. No, I'm good. I'm ready. Mmm. Yes. Healthy flush of the skin. No rapid eye movement. You don't look stressed out. Very well. I won't bother you anymore. Oh, but if I can bother you, just a moment. I recently acquired a batch of materials that can improve your gear. It's not much, but I thought you'd like it. You can't still... still can't believe. You're going to be an officer soon. Yeah, me too. Thanks, Scott. It means a lot. Ah. The lip I movements are bugging me. Especially on that guy. Sean waits for you in the courtyard. <laughs> oh. So stiff, that one. I fear his spine is concocted from steel. A spine prosthetic. How interesting. What if... Oh, and stop by the clinic and come shoot the chit-chat. No, no, that's not... Just don't be a stranger. If you feel ill or need a hand, come see me. I'm always glad to help. Good luck, my boy. Thank you, Scott. Will do. I promise. Okay, that voice acting was a little clunky. Okay. Am I always running? Upgrade your equipment by using workbenches you find. Well, there's a workbench. Okay. Buried a tent, oh. Weighted monkey wrench. Staffs. Build your shield. Nail gun. Cadets gloves. Or various. No item. Cadets jacket. I feel like that's gonna be replaced fairly shortly, so let's do the Canto. Okay, chance of disrupting. Does plus two physical damage, okay. Or plus three chance of critical hit. Well, that's what we'll do. Plus six ship. That's, that's the one I want right there. Upgrade. There we go. Buttons are in weird places, but... Oh. We upgraded the equipment. Oh, there's stairs. Fairly dark game. Okay, no jumping apparently. Fucking mancers. Every time they come around, something new is broken. I fix it, they break it again. I fix it, they break it worse. I'm a modern fucking Sisyphus tasked with pissing in the ocean. 
<laughs> that is actually some pretty good dialogue. Interesting, but we'll see how it actually is here shortly. Oh shit. No! Oh! Oh! Zachariah, today, as you know, marks your final mission as a cadet. I trust you are prepared. Of course, Master. Ready, willing, and able. And a little nervous. Normal and expected. That's why I have gathered together your usual instructors to allow you to warm up and prepare. It's for you to ace the tests for each fighting technique. Prepare yourself. And once you are ready, join me at the station. From there, a train will take us to the mission site. Thank you, Master. He seems so unenthused, the voice actor here. Okay, so she's just standing by... The giant heat ray, okay. 100 people doing squats and stuff. If you would like to practice your technomancy techniques or care to do some staff training, I have time. Train I'm for the staff. I'm always to learn what you have to teach. Excellent. So they let you choose your tutorial missions, cool. Did to switch your... I'd advise you to not try anything. Okay. There's a, a lot of controls in there. to sheath your weapon, okay. Would you care to fight again? Yeah, let's try that again. I'm always honored to learn what you have to teach. Excellent. So that's fast attack. Okay, so that's dodge. Right clicks dodge, okay. Space to disrupt. Left control do a big area attack, okay. Okay, why am I... Oh, because I've already beat him. Okay, that's why I'm not logged on anymore. To fight again? Uh, show me my technique. My technique had never heard. Indeed. Remember to attend to your surcharge risk. I would hate to have an accident. Okay. Okay, so that gives me gun and blade, shield and mace, staff, okay. What? Answer tab. Electric arts. Okay. That's neat. 
Oh, I guess it's waiting for me to hit this guy, isn't it? Or not. This guy. Okay. I've got nobody to walk on to, so that may be. Okay, whatever. Shit! Who the hell swapped out my soldiers for you shit stay? Get it together! Now! Focus! On the target! You hearing me? You miss? You It says grab that. Okay, so I have to press it immediately after selecting it. There's gotta be a better way to do those attacks. Stuff there. No. Erg. Okay, I'm doing that. I'm doing that. I'm. Oh. There we go. I had to assign it to a key. Let's electric arc him again. Bam! We're gonna get my weapon up and okay, shoot to my weapon. There we go. Maybe if I read just a little bit closer. No, we're done with that guy. Another time, Master. Thank you. Of course. Keep in mind, a well-trained staff can be quite formidable. And as you know, the control over our technomancy is what makes us unique. How about a little self-defense training? Sure, trying to use a mason sure. shield. Why not? That's the spirit. Here we go. He's so excited. That's the spirit. Here we go. Straight faced. Supposedly I beat him. So again? that one I gotta take a little bit more practice at, but Simulator. we'll do that in game. Your call. You're gonna wish you had some good defensive training though when you find yourself in trouble. Yeah, yeah, shut up, go away. And finally. Test your skills with a knife and a gun. Not really in the rule book. So if you do, need to be discreet. Let's do it. Let's oh, train to right. use a knife and a gun. Knives and a gun. Mm, they beat us, she said, oh, we trained in all the things. Another time. There we go. 
Don't we have all don't the training or how much faster you can be in combat with light weapons. I okay, don't care about that. Don't care about that. Let's go for this doorway. Hey, doorway. heard from Captain Sean. You're heading out to the station. You leaving now? Yes. Yep, already ready. Let's get on out of the tutorial island and. Halt! Stop right there. We're conducting a search. Look at this piece of shit. Well, well, what do we have here? Huh? Road trash seems lost, don't it? You forget we don't want your kind around here, Trash. Move your sorry ass out of here, or you find yourself bleeding from both ends. I'm sorry. I had you. <laughs> Why the hell are they beating this dude? You piece of shit! Why would I want to hear what you have to say? Why is this piece? Please, I can't! Shut your mouth and just fucking die! The corpse will feed the rats. At least then you'd have a purpose. Such a waste of life. A waste of space. Am I right? A rogue is a rogue is a sack, right? You can dress him up, but... Yeah, let's send this guy on his way. Fuck off, Alan. Before I... Zachariah, we're leaving. Certain people are graduating to the rank of officer today. While others aren't even worth the expense of their time or energy. Let us be off. It's more remarkable things. More remarkable things. Really, it's doing Uncanny Valley for you? I was just looking at it and like, eh. Look, Zack, we are heading for the dome. It was built by the first settlers, a relic itself. And what's there for us? Hey, heading According to, the to dome. reports, looters, who, in our interest, it would be best to keep out of the dome. This here is reminding me a little bit of rage right now. Zachariah, Ooh, I like that. Do you remember your first lesson? On the scarcity of life? Indeed, the very one. Kill a fellow unfortunate and, in this hell, only the more alone we will become. Disable the looters, but spare their lives. Okay, don't kill people. I like the way this is going. Okay, let's switch over to... Really, that didn't hit any of them? Okay, doing some fighting. Take everything, take everything, and take everything. They've got serum in them that I can drain? That's a little scary. Try our shield technique. I'm gonna take all their stuff. We encroach our destination. Take note that enemy forces lie in wait. There, the rocky outcrop. Scale it and report back your findings. Okay. Let's see if there's anything else I can grab first. Do -do 
Do do do. Nothing there. Yeah, it's a bad. Character, mm, yep, take everything. I'm gonna steal everybody's stuff. I might not kill them, but I'll steal their stuff for sure. Okay. Let's try to go in slow. Going in slow. Really? Electrocute him with my hands. The controls are a little weird, like it seems to like snap to places. He doesn't want to move, and then he wants to move too much. Hello, Eric. Yes, that is what it says, that draining serum would kill them, so... We're gonna stay away from that route right now. Oh, is there anything in there that I can get? No. It feels kind of Bioshocky in that, in that effect. Drain the atom from them. Okay, we hit a save point apparently. There are looters gathered at the dome's entrance. A lot of them, but they're not equipped to be more than a nuisance. Take care, nonetheless, Zachariah. That guard there, separated from his group. Sneak on him and the battle will be easily won. Oh, Eric is Spadica or Spazic Spazicus or Sp Spadicus, is that it? It's yeah, you you've got that Z in your name, which is hard to But anyway, yes, I will talk to you and see you tomorrow during the Quintet stream. And thanks again for offering to join us. Electrocute him from far away. Ah, my gun glows red and overheat. And we'll grab his stuff. Apparently nothing of note over here. Okay, let's jump out of there. We're gonna switch over to the staff. Okay. Area of effect. Oh, come on. Damn it. Just call you Spaz. Okay, that will work for me. <laughs> I'm gonna try to sneak this guy. <laughs> Okay, so apparently sneak attacks don't exist in this game. And number one, to electrocute him. And that'll drain a serum. So I don't want to pull that yet. Really? Oh, come on! Okay. 
Arr! I didn't see him do an attack there. So it must have been the guy behind him. Frick. Come on. The camera angle for this sort of combat is... I prefer to have Mad Max did it much more. will give me a new level. Let's deal with that right now. A rogue, warrior, technomancer, guardian. Let's go for this route. This is going to give me upgraded electric arcs. Okay. And there we go. Keep that shield and that open. Come on and bash in. Come on, let me get out of here. Come on, do a flipping around. Jump out of that area. Come on. Whoa. Oh, don't you dare, you. Damn it. Frick. Why isn't there a sneaks attack option? Like, it says there's a sneaking option, but I haven't seen anything that would allow me to sneak yet. Locking weird. Okay, so we got you back here now. Okay. There we go. Nope, jump out of there. Jump out of there. Jump out of there. Come on, get out of this. Locking movement is annoying as balls. Come on. Just electrocute somebody in there. Oh, there we go. Pull out. There we go. No, no, you. Yeah, I, it's it is weird there, Droid. Like it's. And I don't think it's the camera, like, the camera's moving and flowing through things fine. But you press to move, and then the character stays there. 
and then he does like a jump movement instead of smoothly navigating around his space. Okay, and this guy still has nothing, he still has nothing. Okay. And we'll do our level. And what does this give us? Upgraded slash. Gives you 30% chance of dodging blows and shots during the attack. Okay. So we're gonna go for the bladed weapon skill this time. I'm doing my thing. Why do I not have enough like mana or something or like where does that even dis display your mana? Okay. Hello space fights. How are you doing? Yes, it's time for a live stream. Two o'clock on Saturdays. Always two o'clock on Saturdays. Okay. Let's try this again. I, I think it's just that jerkiness. Like, that's the only... Okay, so we're gonna keep the staff out this time. Yeah, they're definitely able to navigate their surroundings a lot better than we are. Like, look at that jump he just did. that girl there we go about bloody time Space Gamer, okay. Now I know who you are. I'm like, who's Space Flights? But yes, Space Gamer. That is a name I recognize. Okay, so nothing out that way. Anything in this tent? No, it's even blocked off. In there. Can't walk that way. Yeah, I think it's just the um, collision and nav meshes. That's the biggest concern I'm having right now. Okay, so there's one there and one there. And we'll switch over to our gun and blade. Oh, that gives me some sort of buff. Okay. Oh, and there's another level up. Oh, no, this is the same level up because I died again. Okay.
This gives me the longest reach, okay. Yeah, there's almost like input lag on it. Because I go to do that jump, and then it does it afterwards. Okay, he can deal with them. Or apparently I can't loot until I'm out of combat. There we go, now I can loot. There we go. It's been a long time since we've seen you then, Space Lights. Yeah, I'm not sure if I'd want to call the combat pre-canned, like, maybe? Okay, there's my area of effect. Fire a uh, electro bolt thingy. Okay. But it definitely is clunky. And it's not even the combat, it's, it's all the movement is very, almost feels like it's grid based. Like I know that's not how it works, but that's how it feels. Hopefully there's a lot more story play in that, and it's not a combat-focused game. Because if this is a combat-focused game, we're going to get tired of this very quickly. Hopefully they got some story points that are worth keeping going. Okay. Let's keep on keeping on. Oh, space has to take off? Ah, right, yes. Time zones. Jump out of the bloody frickin' way! Like, you're doing that one step backwards jump. Do like your big flippy maneuver, dude. We're what, 40 minutes into this game and I'm already yelling at it? Awesome. How come as soon as they hit me I get stunned, but hitting them does almost nothing to them? We'll stay over here where we can't get hit by those bullets. Really? Frustrating combat is an understatement here right now. Eric, or Spaz, and um... Yeah, Mars Warlogs I have it in my library, but I haven't got the chance to play it yet. And then this one came out and I'm like, hey! Let's do this. Plus one of our subscribers requested this game, so... Seriously, I can't jump out 
Oh, you piece of... go getting some health back do the big area of effect thingy which affected nobody what the hell There is no option to sneak past them, Zack. It doesn't seem to be a stealth mechanic, at least at this point in the game. I feel like as soon as you jump down, they see you. There's no other path to follow. At least this map here is fairly linear. Yeah, see, like, I hit them, and they get, like, zero stun effect. They just keep on keeping on. I was, try I was pressing the button to do a heal. You piece of crap game. Oh, See, like, he just kept on running as I'm hitting him, but as soon as he hits me, I get stunned. There we go, that's the only way to stun them, and just for a second, too. Uh, they get a little bit of a knockback, but not a stun. Oh, Zach, you can eat a dick. See, he got a hit right to the face, and that did nothing to him mechanically. Heal up, jump out, jump out, do little spinny kick jumps. Cause that's the only thing that- Oh, screw you so much. Yeah, like, where's my partner there? He's doing dick all. Okay, I've got a minor heal again. You have to die! Oh. Okay. Area of effect thingy. Area of us. There we go. Finally. And you can eat it. Oh, you little twat muffins. Okay, let's see if any of this equipment on me is better. Health injection, focus injection, exploding trap. Health injection. Do not have any of the. Th oh! 
I can make an exploding trap. So that's crafting. Unequipped helmet. How do I equ equip the helmet if it's unequipped? Is it just telling me that it's unequipped? Oh, so I have to hit the back and then... This jacket. Where do I... That's talents. Overview. Components. Stuff. Location. Map. Oh! The map is gorgeous, though. I like that. Defense, plus 9%. Yeah, we'll do that. Bonus, what's this bonus? Resistance to disruption. Okay. Requirements, higher agility to run the cleaver. And I've got no upgrade options. Pants. Okay, plus three. Okay, so we'll equip that. And shoes. And there we go. Let's try this. Jump out of there! Oh, seriously! Frickin' eat it, eh? One of them down! Finally! I'm doing these little side hoppies. Oh, bloody time! Another one goes down. No, you fool! Arg. Rochi, I blame you for this if you're watching. Oh, you die. You are gonna be the first one to die. What? Seriously? I'm getting ping pong between them? Thought that was just a Brawl Hollow thing. Why am I doing a spinny frickin'? There we go. to do a thingy. Oh, about bloody time. You know what? I'm gonna drain all their serum. Oh, Zachariah. Please tell me I did not fail to train you better than this. Fail to teach you the value of life. Especially that of our own kind. Fine, I drain serum from one person. You can be disappointed.
Okay. I need higher agility. Okay, that's just a roundabout thingy. Oh, really? More of them right now? Stay down low for seriously if they aren't seeing us. We're going to recycle a cleaver. button presses to get rid of stuff. Oh, we're going to be switching over to that. Okay, so I have to... Okay. That's not what I want. I want that. Then I want torso. And that. Yes. And then we're going to see how we can upgrade things. So, my staff, which I should have probably upgraded in the first place. So that is a chance of disrupting. That's the one we'll go for. Yes. Oh. Chance of disrupting down. Chance of dis But it does plus more damage. By one. Yeah, I will do that. And then we want that one. And then that one. So that's disruption, disruption, and a damage. Cool. What can we do to our mesh? Up now. Disruption resistance or electrical resistance? Resistance to disruption, resistance to poison, or plus 25 for resistance to disruption. Now nah, we'll go for the. Nah, yeah, we'll just go for that one. Okay. I don't mind the crafting system, other than it does take a few too many button presses. Oh, 
Oh, really? There we go. That does us look better. And then, yeah, we hit them with electricity and then smack them with my staff. There we go. Oh, I've got another level too. Thank you, Spaz. That's the problem of playing on a projector. It's like outside field of view. All that stuff. Okay, so I seem to be save favoring the staff now. So we're gonna do that. Okay, so they want me to go that way. Oh well, I'm gonna check out this spot first. Maybe there'll be another chest over here or something. Nope. Nothing extra over here. Just guys to kill. Must be something ridiculous, Zach, that they're wearing, because it seems to be doing zero damage to them. Okay, we got another save point. Yay! What the hell is this? So they're single hit critters, but they're forming Sometimes critters. Sometimes I wonder if initiating you is the right thing to do. What do you mean? Am I not ready? No, you're ready, Zachariah. With that, there is no doubt. I worry about you and care for your happiness. Once you become a Technomancer, there's no going back. You lose your freedom. From the moment our abilities are brought into the light, to the moment the light is snuffed from our eyes, the Technomancers are nothing but pawns on a chessboard. We have no free will. Abundance forces its will on us. I think about the future. How hard it will become as the ASC rises in power. And perhaps I'm just being paranoid. Forgive your master's little spell. You must focus on more important things. Okay, focus on more important things like killing bugs and getting to this place and doing things. Okay. It doesn't seem like a game that requ uh, rewards you much for... Um... Oh, no jump mechanic is screwing me up, too. This door... It doesn't reward you for it's exploring much. that in our chapel. Accessible only to the combined energies of two Technomancers. does have a point there. Voltage isn't really what you gotta worry about. It is the amperage. Here lies the entrance. From beyond the main room. Where we must go. For being so old, it's in great condition. What exactly, Master, is inside the dome? Knowledge, Zed. The very essence of knowledge. <laughs> I'll drain your serum, thank you very much. So there's knowledge in the dome. And bugs, apparently. Come 
Come on. Stop whiffling. Creatures do not belong here. Their very presence is a danger to the relics. We must seek out their origin. I remember well the first time I came here. I was fascinated. I really thought I was part of an elite. I've become disillusioned since then. If all this knowledge indeed gives us some sort of power, we are still faced with so many obstacles that we can't do anything with it. It's more of a danger for us than a tool. All the knowledge is a danger. And Gimme's here, just sitting back, silently laughing at my pain. You're almost as bad as Droid, Gimme. Bugs, 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 I kill you! Squish all the bugs, squishy, squishy. And then suck out your brain juices, because I'm pretty sure that's what the serum is. Brain juice for me, give all your brain juices to me. They okay, can't go that way, because, you know, jumping. The main room. That would be a ridiculous Console thing in the game. And heed its words. March 17th, 2076. Subject 12. The subject appears acclimatized, pulse elevated but steady, unaffected by any visible health concerns. James, how do you feel? Great! So alive! My heart's racing and I feel like I can take on the world. And it's, and I'm being honest here, it's a bit overwhelming. Subject self report is consistent and substantiated with our measurements of healing other subjects, all of whom produce EEGs indicating activity levels acutely higher than any ever associated with a human not subjected to the mutation. Why is he talking so fast? Side effect, it appears the near tenfold increase in corporeal and cerebral electricity. Dangerous levels that will necessitate the urgent invention of a device capable of evacuating such surplus in order to avoid subject injury. They made technomancers. Yeah, talking about technomancy, about mutations, as if I can't believe. And yet it still might be so. This recording dates to the first settlers, speaks of the first technomancers. Shocking, perhaps? Where did you think our abilities came from? A divine power? I don't, but we have no physical signs of mutation, and I don't know any mutant that has our gifts. And why should any of those things matter? Might not our mutation simply be of a different form? This brings us to the most important point. What you have seen unifies us, unifies the Technomancers. This secret must be kept from all other humans. If this information was discovered by, say, the ASC, we would become nothing but slaves. Our situation is already incredibly undesirable. We are not only isolated, but used as human bombs. Take a walk by the mutant pen in the slums one day. That is what our lives could have been. Don't be dismayed. I have been through this as well. So have all the other Technomancer officers in abundance. Knowledge of this revelation makes you one of us now. More so than your skills. But now is time to deal with the creatures so this is the initiation. Okay. It would be a real shame if the installations here are damaged. For we will no longer be able to hold initiation trials here. Yes. Yes, of course, Master. I haven't found an opening yet, so... They must have breached lower in the dome. Then that's where we must go. Yeah, I don't I mind... the attention of these creatures. At the base of the dome, you will find them. <laughs> they have swarmed here in the other passage. I'm on it. I really don't mind the, um... Voice acting of, like, all the other characters. But Zachariah, the main guy's voice, is not even the voice, it's the the delivery that I'm finding pretty damn painful.
Hello, bugs. Come to me. Must be another one around if I can't drain this one's serum. Oh, there it is. See, not being able to loot in combat is also annoying. Because there's no reason I shouldn't be able to loot in combat if something's far enough away. And if I choose to loot in combat and something else comes to attack me, that's my own damn problem. So let me loot in combat. And Rafik's here! Wanna climb down? Not yet. I wanna go in this other room. Come on. There we go. Drain all their serums. Yeah, I see the new Oh, another level up. Thanks, Levi. Thought I just saw and grabbed it. Nice, droid. Nice. Okay, so this needs serum, a health injection. Okay, so we're gonna build some health injections. Build two of those. Perfect. And key for my level. Needs agility. Okay. Okay, Technomancy then. Prerequisite, something I can't read because the red text is horrible. Oh, it needs one point. Thought it said I had a level up. I do have a level up. Remaining points, three. Total points spent. Then why is it telling me I've got a Oh. Attributes and shit. Okay. We're going to increase our agility, because maybe that'll make us move not like aids. That's the one I've currently got on. And why is it giving me something It's not as good, so... Uh, it may just be saying I've got something new, so... Grab a lower into the beast. <laughs> Spitting acid at me or some crap. At least you know when combat's over when it allows you to loot stuff. I guess that's a bonus of that system. Zach being nicer. It's a it's a weird game, droid. I'm not sure how to peg it yet. Cause now we're walking through and just slaughtering these things with one hit. But like the first group of human enemies you find, like how many times did we die doing that? Just ridiculous this setup.
Okay, if you aren't gonna give me anything to find over here, why make those little areas? Ah, you gave me something to find here. Good. A studded club. Cool. Take all the things. And it doesn't let me jump down off there. There's nothing else in here that I saw. So we're gonna jump down off this edge. Come on. Yeah, like it's whatever. Yeah, like, I'm not hating this game yet. But I also am definitely not loving it. It's pretty. I'll give it that. Like, it's a... I really like the atmosphere. The combat is infuriating. The atmosphere is intoxicating. story so far is a little bit unengaging. I guess the, the story is okay. It's the prota protagonist's voice acting which is unengaging. Oh, there's another crate I can grab. Right over there. Futuristic Dark Souls. Except for I hear a lot of people like Dark Souls. This one's combat system doesn't help with anybody liking it. And we'll take all those things. You got these dead trees in an exposed to atmosphere biodome thing. The big fans that are still trying to run like this. That's a cool spot. Where does it show? Oh, it's that little blue hexagon there. Just snipe people with my lightning hands. Okay. Take it, something's gonna happen that I don't like. Yeah, the, the leveling system seems a little bit quick and... Holy crap, maybe it had to be quick. Okay then. some sort of like Zerg queen over here.
Come on. Big red sack. Just stay in close enough to. Nope, don't stay in close enough. Gotta jump out of there. Yeah, we'll try to kill this man mantis looking thing, okay, Zach? I can't say anything like that, Rafiq, because I've got no idea what Dark Souls is like. Really? There you go. Let's we get that one. Okay, so we got a level. Let's do the level. And we'll level up our Technomancy so I can hit it with range. And there we go. Study club instead of the monkey wrench. Okay. We'll go for a club instead of a monkey wrench. Fair enough. Science, or I can do extra crafting. Experience, traps, stealth, ex or explore, uh, exploration, not experience. <laughs> the big mantis from Star Wars. Yes. That is awesome, Gimme. Hmm. Let's use steal items while being stealthy. Let's see you make stealth attacks again. So you have to unlock stealth to make stealth attacks. Okay, we're gonna try their stealth mechanic. Ackley, that's it. Thank you, Zach. That was a smoother transition on this one. If I'm Padme, the Ackley better not rip my pretty white blouse. Then I'll be pissed. didn't like that now, did you? Oh, really? Oh, I, I don't have enough energy to do that? So I, I can do smaller... Oh! Yeah. 
use a hell. Jump out, jump out, I can't jump out, okay. Really? I jumped right into that one. Damn it! Not sure whether to thank or to hate Simon Rhodes for requesting this game. I'm sure I'm gonna feel good about it when I'm finished, very much like Wolfenstein. But the actual playthrough of it is gonna be a little... a little less than fully enjoyable. Didn't get it in the nads. This does not like getting hit there. Up in there, get in there, get in there. Lightning its balls off. Use a health serum. Come on. Oh. Thank you for sending your children, right? It, it just killed its own thingy. <sighs> Why did you do this to me, Rochi? Swipes do like a quarter of the area we're standing in. We're gonna give it some electronic stimulation down there, is what we're gonna do with our staff. Oh. 
Get out, get out, get out, get out, get out! Come on, face me. Why is it turning away from me? Is it blind? There we go. Come on, let me get out of it. It's, it's like it was just getting steamrolled. Ah. Stay behind you. That's slower damage, but still does damage. my jump you freaking bitch dragon I cuz Get on out of there, do a health serum. Okay. 
Got the electro shivers. Did we just lose the dome? Really, that's okay. Except for this guy doesn't keep going and going and going, he gets zapped down. Who bore witness to the secret with your own eyes. Who knows in your heart of hearts that the revelation that he bears is true. And who has understood that this knowledge could cast us into endless pits of despair. As you drink the sap of the world, the water that feeds our lives. Abandon the one you thought you were and instead become our brother, Zachariah Manser. I think I'm underdressed for this occasion. Together we have shared the water and secret. Can you swear to forever protect the knowledge of the earth and to dedicate your life to finding it again? To defend and protect our secret, even with the sacrifice of your life, if need be? I swear. Then welcome, my brother. Right, Eric is like, th this dude's twitching it with electricity, Let let's grab that hand that's just freaking out. Because that's a good idea. I know you must be troubled by what you've learned, and I assure you that it's no less troubling to me. But be proud of what you are, and know, no matter what, we are by your side. And that this initiation, as horrid as it may be, makes you forever our brother. You showed the courage of lions beneath the dome, and for it you have been made an officer. So I imagine, now that you no longer need my guidance, they will send me elsewhere with the great and endless pride of having been your teacher over these few years. The honor was mine, Master. His, no. his voice acting no, is just so flat. It's just so now. flat. Go. Take your assignment as an officer. Count the blessings you've amounted. Those that allowed you to avoid the front thus far. Captain Eliza is waiting in the barracks. She's harsh, but fair. But before you find her, 
We all know the regulations. Technomancers get no leave from the front in times of war. So being here, I can't even sneeze without a report being written up. But you, you have a free pass. I need you to go to the exchange district for me. There's an itinerant merchant there who was supposed to arrive yesterday. Just meet with him. The merchants have no ties to abundance and travel among us like shadows. They hear things, whisper things, and pay people to forget they are there. I'm looking for information on any archaeological discoveries that could expose the Earthlings. Information that would help protect our secret. Ask him if they've heard of any such finds. Yes, Great Master, as you wish. Good, Zachariah. But take care that not a single soul knows what you're after. Not a single soul can hear your exchange with the merchants. Nobody can hear me talk to people. Because that would be bad. Okay. The movement is much more responsive in town here. Yeah, just hang out with your staff out, eh? Because publicly carrying weapons, that is just something we want everybody to do. Okay, so that's not where I want to go. So we're in a dome ourselves here. Okay, there's just a pile of stuff that I can search. Cool. Keep an eye out for piles of stuff. Giant, like, tank caltrops. Why would you put these here when it's right in front of a wall anyway? That's unnecessary. The Underworks. Cool. Is that something to search? Yes, it is. That one was poor quality leather. Nice. Hello, dude. Ah, does this come through to the other side as well? That'd be nice. Oh, but wouldn't it tingle so good? This is beyond my skill level. Zach, wouldn't it just tingle so good? Well, that's one way to unlock it. Oh, looks like a pile of scrap over there. Yes, it is. And nothing in that pile of cra scrap. Okay. Oh. oh, and right where I started. Awesome. Techno trees. Okay. Someone just left some scrap here, and it has nothing in it. That map does come in handy. Go 
this area is just packed up for the night, then why do they have all their goods still open? Either there's no theft, or this world just isn't populated enough. Great Master said the caravan would be right here. The stand looks like it's been deserted. I'll question the neighboring merchants. Ask the Merton merchants, merchants. Mr. Manser, it's a pleasure to make your acquaintance. Big on weaponry, I hope. What can I get you? I was expecting a caravan in the stall next door to buy a few things. They arrived yesterday, but truth be told, I think they found some trouble. <clears throat> I wasn't there when it happened, but from what I heard, some people were looking to talk, and talking turned to shouting, and after that, they were seen down in the slums, I, I hear, and then they were dragged into some warehouse. Where has the Whatever slums? they did, they're in big trouble now. If you're looking to help them, you better find them fast. Well, while we're here, I might as well take a look at stuff. Okay. Kukri, or however that's pronounced. Open works too. Precision gun instead of just a nail gun. And so they want to, okay, yeah, let's get that. Not enough serum, okay, so serum is our currency. So if I use it for crafting, I don't have money to buy stuff. Okay. Okay, so this cool techno world. See the techno mancer. Shh, they're unstable. Anything can set them off. Let's talk about something else. Okay, okay. We never see them around these parts. Yeah, it just seems a little, little vacant. Like there should be a bit more going on. Okay, so this wasn't where I wanted to go, except for it is, because a crate. And we'll take everything. music hard switch up on that music though okay so this is my room there's nothing in my chest straight and then once it opens up and then right there lieutenant zachariah manson <laughs> yeah just you jump right out of your chair over here captain eliza major welcome to my unit the honor is mine captain for now we're stationed in town and focusing on missions intended to maintain order and safety among the civilians here are the two other fine soldiers making up your unit for the time being. David Ward and Jeffrey Hunter. My pleasure, Lieutenant. Congratulations and... Leave the ass-kissing for later, soldier. Lieutenant? Yes, sir, Captain. Excellent. 
Moving on to more pressing matters, our mission just came in, and it's aimed at smothering regime opposition. According to the intel the ASC gave us, those terrorists live in the slums and are plotting several attacks to undermine our corporation. Okay, your mission is to the infiltrate slums. the terrorists, stop the attacks, and find your way to their leader, Bulgakov. Bulgakov. Orders are to capture Bulgakov alive. We're going to drain him for intel about other terrorist cells and dismantle the entire network. So beat him only as much as you need to take him. You got it, Captain. Move quickly. The longer you take, the more risk there is to the citizens of Ophir. And I won't have that. Before you go, though, there's one more mission. One requiring speed and discretion. We have deserters in our ranks, Lieutenant. Deserters planning to flee like rats through the city's underground. That won't happen. Do you understand me? You find them. And you eliminate them, eliminate each the deserters. And everyone. That seems harsh to you. Setbacks against Aurora have ruined our reputation to the point that every action we take is scrutinized and extorted by those seeking to gain from our fall. A mass desertion would spell scandal if it became public. You catch them before any word of their escape comes out. So move now. You only have a few hours. Okay. Every hunter. Weapons guy. Resistance to disruption or extra damage to gunshots. Let's do gunshots. Oh. Okay. Let's get the proper map. Find deserters. Investigate opposition. Find deserters. Investigate opposition. Okay, so if I continue straight through, I'll hit that. And there you go. Sounds great, but where do we start? The slums. They must have gone home to ask for help, so we should pay their families a visit. I'm sure our escapees will be around. I find it disgusting chasing my own companions. Okay, so we go up the stairs, then to the right. The pile here again. Apparently, since I've already searched it, I can't search it again. Oh, now we can sprint. Our army's not doing so hot. Don't know if our generals were old or the soldiers saw. We've been on the leaves and saw the body. Yeah, pretty much there, Zach. Pretty much. The slums. Now let's be discreet. So, um, because we need to be discreet, let's send in the guy that shoots lightning from his freaking hands. That, that's discretion for ya. Okay. Why do the slums look more lived in? Space prostitute? Blue hair. Nice. And I see I need back there. Make the 
slightest move, you're a dead man. Make the slightest move, you're a dead man. Get me out of here. Get me out. Get me out. Get me out. Let me shoot his ass. Uh... We'll switch over to the staff. How does my big area of effect thing swipe right through them? Hmm, found some of the deserters anyway. Okay, so we go and we take a right at the space prostitute. Did a dodge while he was uh, infuriating, infuriating combat. They're good at this in this game. Oh. It's everybody I've come across so far has that higher armor rating than I do. Plus, the movement system sucks. And I get shot in the back. Thanks, guys, for helping me out. Ooh, that was my elbow that you just heard pop. Oh, come on. I didn't 
advise you to not try and Come on, guys, let's get him! Get me out of here, and no, don't jump! I was pushing S to roll out of here. And, oh, ah. Their dodging mechanic is horrible. And I thought I was supposed to be able to, like, stealth people. Switch to stealth, stealth stance with alt. Nice! Thank you for telling me that when I selected the thingamajigger to get stealth abilities. Like, look at how little damage that's doing to them, and yet they drop my health like ridiculous. Like, one hit's taking out a third of my health. They've got huge protection. What the? Nope, nope, nope. Goodbye, game. Goodbye. Okay, well, that's Saturday's stream for you, everybody. Technomancer is a very pretty game with a beautiful atmosphere, although maybe a little underpopulated, that is aggravating as all freaking get out. So yeah. Goodbye, Technomancer. We will return to you on Saturday. And until then, you can suck a dick. Yes, that was Technomancer. Angry, angry game. Or make me angry game, but whatever. Um, yes, yeah, so tomorrow at 4 p.m. So at this time, right now, uh, we're going to have a open stream of Quintet. So everybody's will, able to join us. Uh, Spadicus who is another one of the developers. So we had Carmine last week. We're actually going to get Spadicus this week. So that's that's exciting. We're going to have another one of the Quintet developers joining us. So great. And yeah, so tomorrow at this time, or five minutes before this exact time. And um, yeah, sometimes I got to mix it up, Zach. Suck a dick, eat a dick. It all means the same freaking damn thing. Screw you, game. That's all it means. But yes, Technomancer. That'll have a special place in our recycle bin. Aggravating game. But yes, we'll be back tomorrow around this time for Quintet. So please, everybody, feel free to join us. Get on the Discord server, which is in the description below, so that you can be in the chat with us all. And yes, we will see you tomorrow. Oh, there may be another developer joining us. Who else may be joining us, Spedicus or Eric? Is it going to be Carmine as well, or is there someone else that, that we have not yet met? Okay, so Carmine will be busy. We may have a surprise dev joining us. 
the unknown developer. <laughs> okay, but yes, tomorrow quintet, and then Monday... Monday something. There'll be something on Monday. Oh, right, I think I promised Gizmo that this coming Monday we will have a Brawlhalla stream. So, another free-to-play open game, guys. So, if you guys want to join us in Brawlhalla, I think we can have up to eight people in a match. So, yes, Monday we're going to do a Brawlhalla stream, because I promised that to Gizmo, which I just remembered. So, um... Oh, and the... The surprise dev that may be joining us tomorrow is na His name is Teeth. Teeth03. Okay. Well, look forward to seeing you later, Spadicus. And yeah, maybe meet Teeth as well. And make sure he has a, um, a link to the Discord so that we can set him up with the correct permissions for tomorrow. So, that's it. Super rambly sign-off. I'll see you all later. And yeah, tomorrow, Quintet day after Brawlhalla. It's going to be a busy weekend of streaming. So we'll see you later.